Okay, pal, put your book away. We're here. Keaton, let's go. One sec. I'm at the best part. I have to deliver my payroll. Ten minutes. I want to wait here. I won't open the door for anyone. I promise. <sighs> okay, someone bothers you. Lean on the horn and honk like hell. Dad, you worry too much. Okay, you win. I just want to talk. I'm not going to hurt you. Come on. Hey, Jake, how's your job been going? Sucks. Danny, you know everybody. Maybe the Equinox? Hey, why don't you stay for lunch on me and we'll talk about it. I just ordered. Somebody's taking Keaton. Taken? What do you mean, taken? Gareth left him in the car reading for a couple of minutes. He's gone. He's my son, too, and he waited two hours before calling Okay, where is he? Back at the restaurant. Nobody saw anything. I'm gonna come with you. Can you take over? Yeah. What was he reading? What? I don't know. What does it matter? The book was left behind. Some stranger snatched him, but if he took it with him, probably it was somebody he knew. Who was that? So, good luck. You've really never been in a front seat before? I'm not even like that, Paul. That's retarded. <laughs> you drink as much as you want. <laughs> okay, drink it. Have you ever trunk surfed? What? You know, when you ride in the trunk of the car? You never done that before? You wanna? It's cool. I can ride in the trunk? Yes. Awesome. Yeah, let's do it. I got him. Send me the rest of the money. So is Chunk Serpent cool or what? Keaton? Keaton, hey! 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 Boo! Oh! You got me. Yeah. You got me. What? You were right about the book. Sorry to bother you. Can we talk for Keaton a minute? Keaton took it with him. The cops agree. It's not a stranger. But now they think it's me. Was it? No. No, Arcadia, there's no way. So who is this Gareth who left him in the car? My ex-husband. Well, good luck to you and your ex-husband. No. no, help us find Keaton. Please. Someone took my son. For me? Please? Matthias, you go for später wieder an. Yeah, yeah. Ciao. It's been 19 hours since the Amber Alert, and the only person the cops are looking at is me. Police are a waste of time. Exactly, which is why we need you. Even bigger waste of time. No, no, you were right about the book. Jake didn't do this. The cops won't believe him. Wikipedia said you're a genius. Yeah, I know. Please? Are you gonna make me beg? Wait, are you serious? You think I can help you with this? Yes! yes. Being good at chess means you're good at chess. I'm not even good at, uh, Falker. I'm willing to pay you for your help, Mr. Belagon. He's the sweetest little kid. Look, they're chasing the wrong guy. Who would take my son? Why? Just, just help me figure that out. Please. This is me and Gareth. He owns Hart's Bistro. Kind of famous. We found a pregnant woman on the island. There she is, Louise. And her other kids, her mother, she already had three kids with three different men. She said, I don't care if gays raise my, my child. child. I'm fed up straight guys. I just want you to love my baby. Of Absolutely. Course. And that he has a good life. You know, opportunities, what have you. You got the check? The nutrition, you know, vitamins and supplements. And no alcohol. No or... alcohol, nope. Just beer. And no smoking. Hmm, not too much beer. Just one. No beer. I'll stop cold turkey. It was an open adoption. That's what we all wanted. I saw Keaton a bunch of times a year. More like once. I called on birthdays, Christmas. When she was sober. 
What about the biological father? Apparently that's a multiple choice question. I can be bad. Very, very bad. Why did you and Gareth break up? Midlife crisis. He fell head over heels for a slut, and then things really turned to crap around three weeks ago when poor Louise died. Aortic aneurysm. We fought over whether or not Keaton should go to the funeral. When I was eight years old, I went to a funeral and it scared the crap out of me. He's not going. This is his biological mother, Jake. He already has too much on his plate. Are you Thanks trying to, to you. mess him up? Me? He keeps asking me about you and the feet. Oh, uh, like hell. Ask him. Go. I think using him as emotional blackmail is going to keep us together. What makes you think I want to be together? Then do us both a favor and leave. Maybe. Enough! Thank God. That was the final straw? Yeah. Gareth agreed not to take Keaton to the funeral, and it's the last time I ever got my way. So... Could Gareth have hired someone to abduct Keaton to punish you? Doubt it, but... Have Gareth and his new boyfriend come talk to me and you write me a check for $15,000. I don't, I don't have $15,000. Then it will bounce, but it will give me a few days' peace. If I find him, you pay me what you can afford. Absolutely. What do you know about the sex offender register? You're probably on it. You call a joke. Well, almost. Yeah, okay, why do you want to know? An acquaintance. His son went missing. The Amber Alert? Mm-hmm. Feds maintain the national SOR. No, the real list, the police list. Sex offenders who haven't been convicted. Ha, <laughs> good luck. Never friends with the other dad? Gareth? Um, I've never liked bosses. Hmm. What do you know about the breakup? Gareth, it was his house, so when they split, he seemed to think the kid went with the house. So maybe Jake did the kidnapping. God, no. Jake loves Keaton. And he still loves Gareth. Do you know Gareth's new boyfriend? Everybody knows Naveed. Meaning? Uh, he gets around. Ooh. <laughs> Do you think Naveed could be behind this? Yeah, I think he was out of town. What do you think, Arcadi? Little kid missing this long downtown. Sure. Hi, Keaton. How you doing? I bought some candy. They gave me too much. Would you like some? Open the door. Keaton, you know me from across the street? My puppy, he's so little, he's lost. Did you see him? Vanya, will you help me find him? I need the car. Open the door. I won't hurt you. Grab your book. Move now! Excuse me. Hi. Do you have children? Me? How many? Six. One granddaughter. Oh, an expert. Wait, wait, wait. One, mo one moment. What do you think would prompt the child to open the car door when he was told not to? Ah, uh, the boy on the news? Hmm. Children, listen. If you say don't open the door, they are good. They're uh, responsible. Well, maybe your kids. No, no. All kids in a parking lot downtown is scary. They listen. They lock the doors themselves. Will someone open that door? He had the key. Who? I don't know who. But he had the key. I'm starving. Yeah, me too. Look what I got. That's our dinner. Yeah, told ya. Best dinner you ever saw? Haven't you ever heard of vegetables? Potato chips. What about fruit? Fruit? I got fruit juice. That's not fruit, that's beer. Never heard of fruit beer? That's root beer. You know what else I got? 
Do you like disguises? Like Halloween? More like... More like... Spies. Uh, it stinks. I know. Uh, don't move. I don't want to get it in your eyes. It burns. It's gross. We're going to rinse it out in a second. And what are you going to say if people ask who I am? Oh, hi, Dad. Hey. 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 Bud, no need for tears. No, you got some of my eyes. Uh -huh. Hey, why don't I get to see my real dads? I told you, Keaton, I explained the whole thing. Hey, listen. When we're finished here, we are gonna do something so fun, you are not going to believe it. What? This is crazy. It is. What do you know about being a detective? Nothing. So you're just bleeding Danny's friend dry? So far, yes. I'm guessing you have some intel. Oh, yeah, you're gonna love this. My pals at the PD tell me that uh, the dad's been fighting over custody. Well, I know that. Well, did you know that Jake Vassar threatened if he didn't get the kid 50-50, he'd take him for good. Hmm. Now, the other dad taped the threats and got a restraining order, but Jake kept breaking it. When it comes to children, some people go crazy. Exactly. And Jake Vassar has no way of substantiating where he was when the boys abducted. So basically, you're trying to help a kidnapper build an alibi. Congratulations. I'm relieved the police solved it so expeditiously. Now perhaps they could focus on my fiance's. Jake, put extra food in your fish bowl. You'll be arrested sooner than later. Sam, you are most useful. Jacob. Jake. Okay. okay, just remember, all right? Ooh, you look good on you? <laughs> all right, I'm the gas and brake guy. You're the wheel guy, all right, buddy? Uh, just keep it straight. There you go. Straight, 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 straighter. Good. This is hard. Yeah, but it's fun, right? Huh? Huh? What am I What am I to you? All right, to right. There you go. I want to stop. <laughs> Bellagon, I'm Gareth. Who has copies of your car keys? Half the restaurant. If they send someone to the market and my car's there, they use it. Any one of them could have made a copy. I know who took Keaton. Jake. The cops are all over him. <laughs> then he must be innocent. Look, the reason I came here is to beg you to talk some sense into him. Do you really think Jake could have kidnapped Keaton? Yeah. When I ended things, he quit his job at the restaurant. He lost his lover, his home, his child. Yes. Yes. He's become unhinged ever since, and that is the truth. How do you think Jake killed Keaton? You don't have children, do you? Look, I am praying that my son is fine, and this is just Jake trying to hurt me, so... Please tell him he succeeded. Why did the police have Jake on a list of suspected sex offenders? Youth records are supposed to be sealed even from adoption agencies. So what happened? When he was 17, he was arrested for having sex with a younger boy who lied about his age, and the boy's family dropped the charges. So he's not a sex offender, but that's why the police are wasting their time pursuing him. There are no other suspects. What about, uh, uh, your boyfriend, Naiv? Navid. Navid. Navid, yeah, he was in Palm Springs when Keaton went missing. He spoke to the police three times. But not to me, and I asked for both of you to come here today. Well, he's coming after work. Mr. Pelligan, you ever wonder why Jake didn't hire a real private eye. Someone who can actually leave the hotel. Save on travel expenses. I read about you. I know you haven't been able to walk out the front door in four months. Maybe he's trying to hide something. Or someone. And if you really want to help find Keith, maybe you'll stop playing games and set your sights on Jake. I can walk out if I want. Yeah. Sure you can. why Jake didn't get a real private eye? Please, my kid is out there every minute that goes by. You got anything, Arcadi? 
Nothing. How can one guy think he's smarter than the entire police force? The hubris. The hell does hubris mean? Why are you working on this and not Rosemary's murder? Such a hypocrite. Hey, drunk guy, answer it. Go away. You play? The word checkmate is Persian, so am I. But I play different games. Probably not solitaire. Gareth just drives around all night looking for Keith. I finally put him to bed with a fistful of Ativan. Why don't you go out looking? He's not wandering the streets. Someone has him. Maybe Jake. That's what Gareth thinks. I was in Palm Springs when Keith went missing. But you know, I mean, Keith, we're buds. It's called a book. <laughs> it's a different cover. This is the British edition. Ah. Uh, you know, if you use your eyes, you don't have to touch everything. Aren't you, what's that called? Afraid to go outside? You just. Stuck in here for months, going psycho. So did you just come over here to remind me of your alibi and how close you are to Keith, or did you just come here to get on my nerves? <laughs> Answered the question. Oh, I thought it was rhetorical. Leave. No. Fine. This is about your girlfriend. Put that down. Put... Hey, hey, hey. All right, I, I'm leaving. Okay. But I don't see how a pathetic, washed-up Russian will solve anything. Oh, right, right. Uh, okay, so, um, maybe it was a, a stranger, someone walking by? Police have resources. Let them investigate stoker's discipline. Okay, so, uh, probability, right. Um, relatives, friends, colleagues, uh, someone who hates one of the dads, one of the dads? You're not thinking strategically. Uh, My knight? No, the puzzle, the puzzle about the little boy. <clears throat> okay, you mean like motivation? Yes. You kidnap a child for money. There's no ransom demand. Okay, so that leaves revenge, murder, uh, sex. Or maybe he wasn't kidnapped, maybe he wandered off. He lives downtown, he's not gonna wander off and get lost, and I doubt he's out hitchhiking to Mexico. Someone took him. You're going to help me find this boy. <laughs> really? Uh, sweet, how? By finding out about Gareth's boyfriend, Naveed, and why he's so anxious to advertise his alibi. Uh, Danny? Right. Hi. Danny, this is my colleague, Steve. Uh, Sam, Sam Besh, Samuel. Uh, Sam. Hey, hey. Sam. Samuel. Danny used to work at Gareth's restaurant. She'll find people for you to talk to. They'll do anything for Jake. They were out all last night putting up posters for Keaton. <sighs> Sit down. And on your way back, could you please find me a magnum of aspirin? Jake's a dream, but he was a waiter, so he knows how to be a human being. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, so yeah, got it. Um, can you tell me about Navid? When he eats or drinks here, he's comped that he doesn't tip. What does that tell you? Known him since he was with Frank Devine. What a mess that was. So you're a detective, Sam. What's that like? Cool, yeah, it's, it's awesome. Been doing it long? Yeah, so, did Naveed ever talk about Keaton? Naveed talks about Naveed. Look, I get off at 2 a.m. What are you doing at 2 a.m., Sam? Homework. Who's, who's Frank Devine? And Naveed's ex-sugar daddy. My break's over. Where can I find Frank? Boop! <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> hey, keep reading. You're gonna need glasses. Is that true? Yeah, sure. See? I got stuff to teach you. Did you talk to my dad? When am I gonna see them? Soon. 
got you some gear. Some really cool stuff. Can I call them? I don't gotta sell. I know their email. Dude, do you think I got a computer? You should get a smartphone. <sighs> hey, listen. Tonight we can go camping. What do you say? You ever sleep in a tent? I miss my bedroom. Buddy, you gotta cheer up, okay? You and me, we're gonna have some crazy times, okay? What do you say? I wanna see my dad. Yeah, I know. We're going camping. Just put this book away. Naveed leave with him? Uh-huh. Damn, one moment is the hotel prick. Dick. Hotel Dick. <laughs> That's better. Would you refill my latte, please? Your friend, Jake Vassar, the uh, innocent guy, just got collared. Yeah, and I witnessed Tom leaving Keaton down an alley around the time he vanished. And he just showed up now? In Russia, we say he lies like an eyewitness. Well, this ain't Russia. What color are my eyes? Tick, 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 tick. Eh. So much right weaknesses. Yeah, okay, so listen, we're planning your goodbye party for Saturday. Oh, but sadly, you'll be so gone by then. Talk to the sugar daddy, find out what he knows about Naveed, and then call me back. Okay. So what can you tell me about Naveed? Uh, Naveed was a nightmare. Except for the sex. Okay, um... I didn't mind him using my money, snorting my coke. I didn't even mind him screwing my friends. So what was the problem? Jealousy. Constantly. Who is he jealous of? Anyone. Everyone. He was even jealous of Betty. Who's Betty? He's always leaving the window open, the door to the balcony, the fan on. And one day I come home and she had passed. I'm sorry about that. It's... He poisoned her. I know he did. Naveed is a killer. It's him. It has to be. Uh, jealousy. The parents, kids. He gets the competition out of the way. Maybe, or maybe we're missing something. Like what? I don't know. That's why it's missing. Okay, well, why don't you think it's Naveed? He was in California. So he got someone else to do it. I, th I thought you thought it was him. You know how I got to be world champion? By having second thoughts, Sam. Third thoughts, yeah, fourth the, thoughts. But the proof is in the pattern, Mr. Balligan. It's elementary chaos theory. Think about it. Think about this. Naveed hires someone to kill a kid because he's jealous. Go away. You ask for me, Mr. Balagan. Come in. Come in. You need something cleaned? Caviar in the carpet again? No. Have a seat. <clears throat> this is Sam Best. Alcina, what is your last name? Uh, the boy who is missing, uh, Sam thinks his dad's boyfriend is behind it. What do you think? I think it was the father, Jake Vassar. Amazing. Why? He was arrested. It was on the news. Uh, I watch while I dust. <laughs> well, hey, if he was arrested, then why are we doing this? They hired me to find the kid. Have they found the kid? Not yet. You know, it was Naveed. It has to be. No one likes the guy. So, no one likes me. Think about this. What are we missing? Who had the key? Maybe you were right this morning. Maybe he ran away. His dads were fighting. He wanted them to stop. There's no sign of a struggle. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, he took his book with him. He ran away. Mm -hmm. He's eight years old. Where would he go? What do we know about the birth family? Not much. Mother's dead. Father's unknown. When you want to know about something in a family, ask the grandmother. Go online, find the birth mother's obituary. Yes, I'm calling about your grandson, Keaton. Well, I'm not exactly with the police. I'm... What accent? Could you come into the city? Your car was stolen. When? Hello? Sam? Elsina, I need you to go for a little ride. Mr. Balagan, I have a job. A child is missing. Helping the dad they arrested? We're trying to find Keaton. Please. What do you got to lose? The police think that maybe Keaton is gone. The police are sometimes wrong, very wrong. Until they find Keaton, do not give up. I haven't given up. They have. They wanted to talk to me, and then they arrested that dad, and. They never came. Oh! <laughs> Mr. Banagan is one of the smartest men in the world. Talk to him. Louise 
Bruce's three other kids. They live with my other daughter now. I just saw them. Everyone is so upset. I mean, the poor little kid. He loses his mom when he's born, and, and then he loses her again when she dies, and now he's lost? I mean, I, I said to him after the funeral, I said... Jake told me Keaton wasn't at the funeral. Sure he was. Everybody came back here after, and I, I gave him some ice cream, and, and so I... So who brought him there? His other dad. Um, what's his name? Uh, Gareth? And, uh, and his new friend. Navid. Yeah, I thought he was a girl. And who else was there? Oh, um, uh, Louise's uh, other kids, my other daughter, her kids. Who else? Um, uh, Reverend Kathy, Meg, Floyd. And who are they? The neighbors. They're as old as the hills. It wouldn't hurt a fly. And so who else was there? Uh, Louise's friends. Such as. Oh, what's his name? Um, Merritt Singer? Just got out of jail. How long was he in jail? Six, seven years. Eight? Arrested for smuggling weed over the border <laughs> in a rowboat? Mensa. Could be the father. Look at the eyes. You are right, Mr. Balligan. It wasn't David, it was Merritt. I guess we should call the cops. Well, maybe you were right. Sucks, huh? Louise? Yeah. She was an amazing piece of ass. No, they'd bond over drugs. I'm looking for some weed. Can you help me out? Hey, I'm not a cop. Someone told me you could hook me up. I'm trying to get back in the game, but uh, they impounded my rowboat, and I'm broke, and I don't even have a car. You must have called to the boy. Hey, Keaton, come here. I'm Merritt, your mom's friend. Good friend, really good friend. Or at least I was. Take a good look at me, because one day you're going to be as handsome as this. Keaton, where are you, honey? I got your ice cream. Over here, Grandma. Come in. I didn't even know I had a kid. Until a couple of weeks ago when Louise just sprung it on me. No one asked me if I wanted to give him up. We'll count your blessings. The kid's a spoiled brat. His dad's just compete over who can buy him more crap. And it's like every time that Gareth and I are going at it, he just walks in on us. He does it on purpose. The kid's jealous. Isn't that weird? Of me, jealous of me, a kid. I mean, how twisted is that? Very, very. Want. I need you to call some of your pals in the PD. Shouldn't you be packing? Tell them to find a man named Merritt Singer. He may have kidnapped Keaton, who may be his biological son. Now, Merritt may be driving Keaton's grandmother's car, possibly near Duncan. There's the plates. It's an awful lot of maybes. These are uncertain times, Hugo. Where are we going? I don't want to go. I know an old cabin a couple of days in. It's off the grid. We can fish, we can hunt. I want to go home. This is what dads and their sons do. Yeah, you're not my dads. Yes, I am. Hey, I told you that. Yes, I am. No. Yes. From Gareth, a little thank you. That was a big thank you. I won't be spending his money on Navid anymore. He was arrested. I'll drink to that. <laughs> you found Keaton, Art. Thank you so much. Oh, it's Jake and Keaton. That's the kid who went missing. The police found him, thank God. Especially Arkady Balagan and uh, all the volunteers who came out to help uh, look for Keaton. There was hundreds of you. You have something to do with this? Of course you did. I got lucky. <laughs>